back to pass. He's looking out to the left. He's got help. No, that's not help. That was Johnson again. He's gonna. They're looking to decide whether he, we got a touchdown call. Jermaine Try, Johnson came to play tonight, fellas. Trying to find if he put his foot on the out of bounds. We did not see him do that. It looks like he was able to extend. And for plenty more carries tonight. Hel Hello to the catch, and he's gonna get into the end zone. Wow, he shed the tackler. That's found right. his way to the end zone. And he's not even going to Alabama. Uh, for, for a wide for receiver. 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 Yeah. You know, I think they could use him in a pinch for four years. It's going to be a fake extra point. They're going for, for the two, and they had it. That was that was deflected. That was a heck of a play. 298 yards, two touchdowns on 21 carries. Caleb Williams puts the ball in the air. And what it's a, a play catch. by Marshall. Marshall brings it down, and he wants to get some yards after the contact. He's in about the 35-yard line. A great-looking throw here for the first quarter and a half. Caleb with some time, ball in the air. He's got a hit. man, and it is our man. Wow, what a game. Number what five a game. for Gonzaga, Aaron Turner. I don't see any flags. That one's going to stand. What a pass. What great protection. Yeah, he had time. He put the ball over the outstretched hand. Wide. And it's going to be a deep shot to Johnson. What a who catch. Who brings it down. <laughs> what a lead. Oh what a lead. Goodness. Yeah, you never like when the flag goes right up in the air. It's like a long <laughs> no. dart. You, know, you, don't like, you don't want to catch and, a flag. And the referee the, staring the right at you as you walk away from him? Or is it they can get the ball in? Yeah, the old two for one. That That's kick no is good. no good. Short. Marshall's going to come out Looking solo. Here. Wide read left. option, good, good read. Gets his feet under him, and look at this hit right there. Ball head on helmet. And look at Sweeney takes one too. Helms. Looks like they're going to be. Looks like they're going to be. Uh, yeah, they're they're going to be a first down territory, just outside the 30 yard line. Gonzaga driving. Again, Jeff Clay nailed it. Caleb's going to have to get it, exert himself with his feet. This time it's the big man, low weak. Hey, you learn. Marshall. That trips left formation for Gonzaga. It really worked from the last play. And they're going to throw four guys out there. And Caleb's going to tuck and run. He's coming around our way, guys. And he's sniffing something out. He's going to reach over the ball at the 10 yard line. It's a good looking run. Third and short for the Purple Eagles. Coming right at us, everybody. This is going to be a reverse. And it's going to be a pass back to Caleb Williams, who's got nobody. He backs into the end zone. Caleb Williams, touchdown, Gonzaga. I can't stand the Eagles, but that was Philly special right there, wasn't it? it was a little by, the Eagles, it. by the Eagles, I mean the Philadelphia yes. Eagles. Purple Eagles that, that, over that, Green that, Eagles we, all day. That was a version of it. We've seen that play once or twice. This is big. Third quarter, ticking down to an end. 12 seconds as Eric Nigerian steps in. Take a snap. He's looking to throw again. He's going out wide. And he's got Helms and I can't believe this did he guy. Catch it? He did. I <laughs> yes, he did. Woo! I could not believe how good. Right. <laughs> Have we seen this year so far? There's the pitch out wide. Lloyd again. It's gonna get run out of bounds. We refer to it as the, the league. league. Kick is gonna be up. Ooh. Almost blocked. Looking to throw. Quick one. He's got Marshall. Caleb back to pass. Great He's got protection. Marshall. Great protection by Gonzaga's O-line. Uh, here comes the Samantha. They're bringing the, bringing the pressure right here. They sure are, T. Caleb uh, elusive. He's going to get out to the look out. Getting out to the left. Good Lord. That ball he makes the play. Up grabs. <laughs> Turner brings it down. I thought he was going to throw it away. Then I was worried that I it was going to be a game of 500 out there. Here it comes. And it's going to be a tuck and oh, run. Caleb there Williams has a ton of room. He's got his eyes on the end zone. If he can get around that one, yeah, and look, he's got it. What a play. What a play by the quarterback. Five minutes, 46 seconds to go. Gonzaga takes, a, takes, it, takes it to pay dirt. So he can spring him. Yeah, it is. And it was, uh, look at this. Helms inside. He sniffs it out. The sophomore, I think, who's that? The sophomore, Jackson Leggins. Look, who are we to, 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 to question <laughs> what, what their plan is? There's the inside handoff, and it's loose. The ball is loose. 
Josh this Williams was given a half hearted. Oh, oh this man. This could be cute. Oh, man. The math like was the able to cover it. it up. Najarian yes. got back in it. That mean, ball squirted out. That was, oh, man. But we haven't had a game changing play like that, guys, in the second half. Absolutely no. Bad handoff. Yes. Bad transfer. No big game changing uh, turnovers yet. Again, it's football. It's just a matter of time, just a matter of odds. Whether or not Gonzaga can do it in the next four minutes. Lloyd back in the game. Najarian under center. Just under four minutes to go, second and long. Lloyd met. Yeah. Another there fumble. There another ball. Did they get it? Joe Wete does not feel good about it. Oh, the Gonzaga does have it. Gonzaga's got there the ball. That's what everybody's been waiting for. Three minutes, 42 seconds we were in just the fourth quarter. About it. And a big play for the Purple Eagles. No, it looks like if they're no, I think he's going to run man at all. It's man there it is. There it is. Yep. You're going to let Caleb beat the blitz, man. He's going to do it again. He's at the five-yard line. He's going to make a move he's for it. a touchdown. Yeah. Gonzaga That's takes another that score. That's the scenario I'm talking about. If you bring that heat to a great atmosphere. Kamish, thank you so much for so many different reasons. And good luck tonight. You've already won no matter what happens out there. Sure. Bye on your defense here. I mean, the, the way that this, this Gonzaga offense is clicking right now, you got to make a play here. I think that they right. may possibly try and go with a uh, with the screen pass here try to use there we go. again some uh some aggressiveness by this Gonzaga D try to get you know some guys past him. Get some, you know, one of the big playmakers for uh looks like he's hey, in the back so just Marshall so you know before Lloyd. your decision is made there's no timeouts left I wouldn't if I'm, I, I would I would take a knee here Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> the Jerry's gonna put the ball in the, the air. Ball in the air and it's gonna bring it out it's wide it's an incomplete it's pass that is a tough Tough result. Gonzaga's going to get the ball back. And I want to see who's coming back to field this punt, everybody, because I've been looking for play. number six all day. They wanted to make a play. They did not want to get the ball back. And there he is. But instead, they stop the clock and get the ball back with 157. That's plenty of time for somebody like Caleb Williams. Everybody still, else is covered. I still like Caleb running the ball in this drive, guys. Head up. And here we go. Now, that's not what they want. He's got to get to the out of bounds. Look, Look at him at go. Move. I'm telling you right now, guys, this is the way Gonzaga has been doing it. And even though there's only a minute 40 to go, I still think it's the way they should do it. <laughs> Just Caleb wants to throw this ball, and he's going to be under pressure, and that's a smart decision. Oh, my that goodness catch. gracious. That was an unbelievable catch. That Turner, by Turner, Aaron Turner, was number five. In the air by the DeMatha defender, and as it was coming down, he kept his feet inbounds. We, we all thought he was throwing it away. Logan Neely is waiting for him on the outside right. He's going to get rid of the ball. And he's going to get that rid of the ball. For Deep. Grabs. There's a lot of action there. That's this offensive. Flex. This is amazing. The atmosphere is ridiculous right now. samantha has got their hands on him, and Caleb goes down. It's not a sack you want to take on second and long. And Caleb's hurt. He has been he was banged up a couple plays ago, and you, you saw it. He's slow to get off the field. You don't want him to have to come out for a play. Uh, he sucks it up. Hey, that's what you do right there. Hey, Koziah Eisler and Dominic Byron Perry. Marshall, by Great Byron pressure. Marshall uh, got, action here. Byron got to go which, I mean, a full length of the field Marshall. here. Yeah, hey, that would have that would, that been devastating. Look at him limping. And that ball's in the air, and there's, he's going to give his guy a chance, and he's got him. Oh, oh my that. goodness gracious. John Marshall, the security blanket. The field, boys. Surprise, surprise. I have no idea what it was because I'm looking down the field. I don't know what that flag is. Somebody's going to be sick when the referees decide this. Someone's going to be real sick. They're going to call holding on, on, on DeMatha. That play is going to stand. What a play. What a play. What is going on? This is an absolute ridiculous. I can't stop saying ridiculous, but I'm going to say something else. I mean, don't let me say. No, I, know, say. I know. I know. Holy moly. I mean, you just got a guy being held up. The quarterback Sam can barely Sweeney. stand. He talked about Sam Sweeney making it happen. Sam Sweeney. He finally made his mark on this game. Oh, this oh, is. Oh, that was Sweeney on the catch? Yes. Yeah, it was Sweeney on the catch. I had a hard I time just, seeing I, who I that was, for too. I sure it was John Marshall. He's, he spun around like a center fielder. He found the ball. Caleb had the arm strength to get it there. DeMatha there calls their again. final timeout, trying to regroup here with 39 seconds. Look at this adjustment at the end. What a play. 
to Gonzaga, you're going to throw the ball, you're going to take shots at the end zone, at least on, on first and second down. Do not throw the ball anywhere near number one side. Stay away from number one. That's this right. guy's put on a performance, a legendary historic performance. It, don't let him cap it off. Keep the ball away from DeMarco Hellams. Dean Engram comes back into the game after being banged up on the punt return, and he is on the he's on the short side of the field. Hellams couldn't be farther away from Dean Engram. If I'm Gonzaga and I'm going to put the ball in the air, I'm going at number six. And there you go. There's Dean. Oh, my goodness. He was pushed no out of good. bounds. No he good. He's out of bounds. And he's hurt. And he is hurt. We're going to get a replay a of that. What a play. Unbelievable catch. The hits just keep on coming. What a play. Play after play after play. The greatest conference, the greatest football conference in the country is showing out tonight, gentlemen. Sweeney wants the ball, but here you go. We, we saw it. We diagnosed it. Look how high Logan he gets. Neely. Look at him. He's parallel to the ground. Uh, oh, that left foot hit the pylon. That left foot elbow, hit the pylon. The elbow might have hit inside. The elbow might have hit first. If, uh, I, if this is no, the pros, no you're it. there's no replay, but i got to tell you guys, I thought that was a touchdown. That was a touchdown. I'm hard-pressed to, to, to try it again, but there it is again. Once again, you've got the same. And you got him again. That's a touchdown. That's a touchdown. Gonzaga puts the ball in the end zone. There's 29 seconds to go, and Gonzaga takes the lead. There's a flag. Now that's killer, but this is unbelievable. This is not. This is not stop action. That was open on the last play too. Sweeney on that inside slant. What's the flag going to be? The flag looks like after it's going to be after, after, the, after the, the play. After the play. But it is on the ground. We got laundry well, that means again. It's be assessed on the kickoff if it's against Gonzaga. It exactly. Allow for another exactly. return. You guys, it was twenty to nothing. Dematho came into this game and got out of the gate in a way that we we haven't seen someone do. It is against Gonzaga. Zag is going to take the penalty, but they're going to take the score. They're up by three. They're going to kick the extra point here. Try. I don't know who that was the on the defense, point. but the defender brought him down on top of himself and then carried him into the end zone as well. He had brought him down to the one. It would not have been a touchdown. Number seven, Saeed Myers. See a shirtless Pat Judge running through the streets of D.C. Ew. right now. Ew. I mean... This is a big one. This is a big one, guys, because this is going to determine whether or not the math can put themselves in a position to tie with a, with a field goal or not. We all we all kind of thought the Dean Engram play was a, was a touchdown. It's good to see Gonzaga not leave it hanging. Did that kicker get a free, it's good. free run? That's a huge extra point right there. 29 seconds to go. Gonzaga, 40. The math 36. Not what we were... <laughs> Never seen anything like that. Unbelievable. It. Look at this catch. Unbelievable. What a drive. Sam Sweetie, Kevin. By number said, 10. He's going to show up big. That's his drive. Oh, man. That he, is his drive. He picked the right time, didn't he? That was a classy, I mean, classy drive. And you're sitting there looking at Caleb Williams about to have to come out of the game due to injury. They're going to have to bring someone else in and do something different. He sucks it up, <laughs> comes back, and just unleashes the ball. And Sam Sweeney hunted it down like a center fielder. He retraced. He came back around and caught yes, it on the did. inside. And stayed in bounds and the whole time. Bounce. This is... You don't get action like this. You do not get high school football action anywhere like we're getting right here tonight at Catholic University. Hey, you picked a hell of a two games for us to cover, didn't oh, you? Oh, God. <laughs> I'm so proud of everybody in this entire on, on this entire campus. I'm proud of all the students in, in both sides. I'm proud of all the fans. Let's go to Carol Maloney real fast on the sidelines. Well, I just want to chime in about Sam Sweeney. I don't know if you guys have talked about this, because obviously the biggest catch of the night, the biggest catch of the season of his football career, he has committed to Penn State to play lacrosse. Yes, he has. And I thought that was very interesting. That here you go, the WCAC catch of what I've ever seen, right? The catch of the best catch I've ever seen uh, is a guy as a lacrosse player. So I thought that was pretty cool. And all you Wisconsin Badger fans out there, the, on the play before that, I, we, I'm going to go out on a limb and say that Dean Engram caught that ball and, and scored a touchdown uh, before Sam Sweeney was able to do it. But it doesn't matter. Gonzaga did, did it twice. And DeMatha's got 30 seconds here, However, T. However, Gonzaga's kicking it off from their 25. This is going to give Once again, either the Logan matter, Neely T. or Marshawn Lloyd a chance to bring this back. They're going to squib it. It's going to find Logan its way Neely. to number four. He's across at 40. He's, he's going to get to midfield. He's going to make he's going to make his way upfield. He's at the 30, 25, 20. He's going. Oh my go, 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 God! Go, go, oh my God! God. He's right at it. There's no me. flags. There's no flags. I don't see a single oh flag. Oh my God! Unbelievable. No one does it like the WCAC does it. 
He got oh through the God. entire team. He went through the team picture, the entire Gonzaga team picture. He brought it in. The, the Madden players are over in front of their student section celebrating. Look at the pandemonium right now. A squib kick turns into a touchdown. Can you oh, believe no. it? Real. He, and there's still 15 seconds. And there's still 15 Dominic seconds. Dominic Logan Mealy. Number four. Number four in the program, number one in your heart on this day in Heightsville. Shout out to Tommy Ponton. Well done, sir. Here it is. Hey, man. Here it comes. A squib kick. They're going to let it go all the way down. Logan Neely's going to get it right inside the 25. And it's just look a clean that burst look. through that hole. But this is all Logan Neely right here at the end. He stays in bounds. One, two. two. Rubs it off. Oh, and coming right at us. Look at us. You can see us. We're, we can't believe it. I'm, uh, I, I, I'm unreal. Oh, it's hands on head underneath the tent. It's hands on head. The math that puts it three points up. Good. I never thought I'd say there's plenty of time left with 15 seconds in one of the greatest football at, games at, I have at, ever witnessed in my life. Is. That's unbelievable. Unbelievable. Looking at it again. Here we go. Watch him hit this alley right here. He hits Great it hard. Blocking. Two arm tackles he gets rid of. And look at Marshawn Lloyd get look ahead of him. He gets Marshawn an initial Lloyd block on 24. Block oh, man, Marshawn. And they just guys. can't bring him down. They're going, I don't know if they're pull going that. for the ball there. That I was mean, John Riggins-ish right there with oh the pull of the gosh. jersey at the end. Look at hats off. Hats off to this to, to everybody here. We said it before that play, and it mean it even more now. The will to win on both sidelines is absolutely skyrocketing no, to a level over, that I've never witnessed at, 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 at the high school at the high school level. Oh my lord! Three point game. Oh my lord! Dean Engram and Sam Sweeney are back deep. Lucas Warfield, Malcolm Terry standing in front of them to do their best Dominic Logan Neely impression if they get that chance. Tyler DeMath to kick it into the end zone. Make them go a full a full field. Well, Joey Hood has done it. And we got to oh, sell wow. the flag. So, there's Off sides. Another, another chance. Another chance. All another right. chance for someone to, to throw a flag. Another and, chance, and, and a a chance for this kick to be returned. That's right. Although Joey Hood's been putting them five to eight yards deep consistently all night long. All it's got to do is get to the goal line and that this whistle can't be write blown. This. You can't write it. I, I, there's been more action in this exact game than I have seen in football for months. This is, uh, I am so lucky that you brought me in. Man, oh, a part man, of this, come on. That we all put this together, that we get to see here and watch first. something like this. The league, baby. The league. From field level. Hood puts it up. It's coming right at Dean Engram. His foot is going to be planted at the seven-yard line, and he is off. 14 seconds, 13. 10 seconds to go. He's going to be down about the 30 yard line. Caleb Williams is going to take over. They need three points here. They have no timeouts. One thing to keep in mind in high school football pass interference is a 15 yard penalty. That's, That's not right. a spot foul. So you got to hope right now Gonzaga's got to do something off the sidelines. And then there's going to be one or two more shots at it. And I'm telling you, fellas. At this point, 34. Nothing, nothing will surprise me. 34 yard line. Caleb Williams looking for some magic. He's going to got to get the ball deep, and they got to get out of bounds or score. <laughs> One of those two. Samantha rushing four. Out Smart. of bounds inside the 50. So here it is. Four seconds to go. Now Caleb Williams has got the oh, arm. He does. Hey. At Catholic University, the Washington Catholic League, and here comes the Hail Mary. Would anyone be it surprised? It is Sunday. <laughs> Would anyone be surprised at this point? We led the game. We led the day off with a Hail They're Mary before the O'Connell. Unfortunately, St. Mary's Riken game. We all said one. Here goes Caleb, Dean Engram, Marshall, and Sweeney. What did Lou Holtz say? God doesn't care, but his mom does. Is here God purple? Is. We're about to find out. Ball's in the air. And then it's going to get there. And, and if somebody caught, caught that, did somebody, somebody catch that? Somebody caught it. Gonzaga, did they Are catch that? Me? Touchdown, Touchdown. Gonzaga! The, the Gonzaga oh, Purple oh, Eagles win the WCC on the last second on a touchdown Hail Mary pass. Down pass. I cannot believe it. Me. That is the greatest high football this. game 
Look the, at this pandemonium all of us right man. now. Catholic, who brought it down? I haven't even seen who brought it down he yet. Has no idea. My guess is John Marshall. I'm guessing John Marshall. All I too. saw, all I saw was that ref put his arms in the air. We take a peek at the replay. I have Holy. never witnessed anything like this in my entire life. I mean, Caleb Williams put that ball at 60 yards in the air. Unbelievable. The team of destiny has finally pulled it out. That is the craziest high school football Here we game. go again. His foot is going to step up. His foot is going to be on about the 45. No, we're going to call it out the 41. And he threw that over 60 yards in the air. Here we go. That looks like John Marshall. Is that John Marshall? It looks like two Gonzaga guys might have cradled it between them. The uh, number 15 and number 14. Against the best two safety comp the best safety combination in the nation. It is John Marshall. John Marshall comes out John with Marshall it. John Marshall, he's got the game started. He's the one they went through oh early down 20, gosh. and he finished it. I've Let me never tell you something like this. John Marshall, he's, going, he's off to Navy, is that right? He's going to Annapolis? Uh, oh, yes, sir. Who better do you want wearing the greatest uniform this country has? The, the stars and bars. John Marshall, pride of Gonzaga, pride of the WCAC, taking his show to Annapolis. What a what a game, guys! Unbelievable. Historically you cannot speaking. write that, gentlemen. Uh, we were kind of kidding when we said there was only that, 15 seconds left. It was an eternity. I wasn't kidding. Oh I said it wouldn't goodness. surprise me. You go back and listen. I said, would you be surprised? A Catholic University the Catholic League Championship, and a Hail Mary is the reason why the Gonzaga Eagles defeated the Mathis Stags 46-43. Never witnessed anything like this. Carol's going to have to put, make sure she's grounded for this uh, this post-game interview oh, coming yeah. up. Do we have, do we have, let's get her microphone on here. Carol, we got you. I, I am still shaking my head. I My life flashed before my eyes when uh, Nelly returned it because the whole team was was running, it was a running of the stags down the sideline, about to take us all out, and then that happened, and you can see a lot of emotion here as we're on the uh, DeMatha sideline, uh, a lot of a lot of tears. As, what, sure. Three, three lead, lead changes in a minute 20, wasn't that right? I mean, it was oh. an insane ending. Oh, my Lord. I, uh, it's unbelievable. We, we, we were saying it, and we weren't just saying it. When we said it was six minutes to go, if you three think the game's over, you couldn't 30, be more wrong. 40 seconds, Carol. How long? Uh, I think it was three lead, lead, uh, lead changes under 40 seconds. 40 seconds? Yeah, mm. three touchdowns. Seconds. Yeah, three touchdowns. That's unbelievable. Um, I'm going to try to get into that yep. scrum, and mm -hmm. they're, they're shaking hands and now. And we'll watch another replay of, of the uh, Caleb Williams bomb there. It's a straight-up 60-plus yard throw. It gets deep. Look, highest point, number 14. He comes down, I believe, on top of number 15, uh, Justin Ball, and I want to say, and I can't see, none of us can see, but I think Justin Ball gets underneath Marshall and helps him make this catch without it going to the ground. Hey. Here comes Marshall out of the scrum with the ball. A definitive touchdown call by the back judge. Yes. Not anything, not anything to uh, to shake your to, to sneeze at. Gonzaga team of destiny. They did it. Do you know what had to happen for, him, for Gonzaga to win in the last two weeks? The amount of things that went down for Gonzaga to win in the last two weeks. We're going to come right back with Carol Maloney and a little bit of post-game coverage. Behalf of First Amendment Sports, we thank you. We will see you momentarily. Please join.